Okay, we have a series of cash flows. It's constant in this amount, 1260. Goes on forever, and the first cash flow occurs one year from today. So what is this? We have a name for this, and that name is perpetuity. This is a perpetuity. Drawing it on the timeline, we have this. Same cash flow, it repeats forever. That's why we have infinity on the timeline. And the first payment occurs in time one. And so that's that's a big deal to us, this time one first cash flow, because that indicates our standard out of the box per perpetuity formula will work just fine. Okay, so uh, what do we ask for? We're asked for the present value. Okay, so we're asked for today's cash equivalent, so the amount we would swap today for this series of cash flows. So that's the present value of the perpetuity. We know that the present value of a perpetuity is the payment amount divided by the discount rate. So here we have 1260 in the numerator and a discount rate of 7%. And the present value of this perpetuity is $18,000. And so that's the answer. And so how do we think about this? We think of $18,000 today and this series of um, equal payments starting next year all the way into uh, infinity. We think of those as equivalently valuable, and so we would swap one for the other.